Welcome back to 3D TV. Are you ready for another edition of Shooter's Paradise? But wait a second. How does a guy make 402 threes last season, go 0 of 12 in one game, then a week later go 13 of 17 from three? Well, we're talking about Steph Curry. Let's take a listen. What's up, NBA fans? It's your boy 3D for another edition of Shooter's Paradise. And I'm here with one of the... I think he's one of the best shooters in our game. Let's get right into it. Steph, how you doing? Doing good. How you feeling? Feeling good. How's the gooseneck feel? <laughs> it's up there. I'm hanging it, holding it, leaving it, and uh, it's feeling good right now. Let's tell the fans, though, and for the young kid back home, you didn't wake up a three-point shooter. Being a great shooter, you got to start in close first. You make the left-hand floaters, you make the right-hand floaters. Talk about that preparation. Yeah, it's about to develop and touch and feel. Um, every time I start, I get ready to work on my shot from the time I was in high school, even before that to now, it's starting to paint for a lot of different reasons. You want to see the ball go in. Um, you want to develop that touch uh, and get your rhythm right before you step out to the three-point line or a little bit further out where you, your mechanics have to be right for you to have that consistency that you want. So um, it's all about just developing confidence. It's been well documented before the game, you do your ball handling routine. You shoot the shot from the tunnel, you shoot the half court shot. Explain that mindset that every night when you go into the game, you believe you're not gonna miss no shots. Yeah. Um, I like to have a little bit of creativity um, and kind of challenge yourself a little bit. The tunnel shot's not really relevant to, <laughs> right. to right. basketball, but right. it's a challenge that, um, you know, I get five shots to make it and I kind of have to lock in and, and feel the ball, mm -hmm. see the angles. Mm -hmm. I think that translates to the game because no matter where you are on the floor, it's a different angle, but. Um, you have a split second to kind of you know, lock into that moment, rise up and shoot it and have the confidence that's going in. So um, all the stuff is balancing the creativity, the, the challenge, and also the rhythm. You have really mastered the, either the dribble step back or you fade off the screen, the step back, the ball around your back. Where did that come from? <laughs> that's just being in the gym um, and trying this stuff, you know. Um, we always used to work on like how quickly can I get the ball from the ground mm -hmm. to my hands to be able to shoot it. Right. Um, in the league, there's obviously not a lot of time in, in that moment where you can create space and get your shot off. Um, so you want to have that transition be as quick as possible. Oh, Stephen Curry with some magic. I'm, that I'm the first person to try it, but you just you know bring it around your back, away from the defense. Whether they reach it or not, I can get into my shooting pocket and shoot it. And it's just, you gotta have balance with right. it too. So right. just just creativity. You know, gym rats find different stuff. Um, you know, to work on and, and to you know, keep them interested. Curry missed the layup. Curry long range three air ball missing badly. Explain to our fans that even if you do miss two free throws or if you miss your first five shots in the game, the mindset is I'm gonna make my next five. Oh, for sure. Be Explain sure. that. It's all built on your, your preparation, your, the, the reps that you put in before. Uh, like I was talking about building confidence. So I know I put the time in to get my mechanics right, to work on my range. Um, and basketball is basketball. You know, you can't really explain sometimes when you miss. Right. But the, the mentality is it's not going to you know, make me shy from the next shot. Um, and I know when I get another opportunity that that was going in. And I have that belief it's all the way through my, my follow through until it hits the rim, hopefully it hits the bottom of the net. If right. it doesn't, I have the same mentality the next time. You know, shooters want to shoot and mm -hmm. shoot well, and no matter how the game's going, you got to push through it with that confidence. For the record, yeah! I try to tell fans the reason we call this segment Shooter's Paradise, because once you get in that zone, it feels like paradise doesn't. The rim looks like the ocean. Um, you know, when you get into that zone and that uh, paradise, and it's it's pretty special. You know, just knowing if I get a good look and you know, and not even a good look. If I just get a clean you know, release to the right. basket, then I'm pretty sure it's going in. So I relish those moments, um, whether it's for the course of the season, like 54 or two, or in the middle of a game where you you know. Just unstoppable, we'll have a couple heat checks to go in. Right. All that kind of stuff. You just, you just have fun with it. Hurry three!
Shooter's paradise, the mind of a shooter. Now you understand why Steph Curry shoots the ball so well. Well, it's safe to say he's the best shooter to come out of North Carolina, and it's safe to say Michael Jordan is the best player to come out of North Carolina. Well, I took a trip up to D.C. and sat down with the Hall of Famer, David Aldrich, and we picked our top five from the DMV. All right, put you on the spot. Yeah. Your, your top five guys out of D.C., Maryland, Virginia basketball. Ooh. I didn't see Elgin play. We saw the highlights. I saw the highlights. Here's Elgin Baylor of the Lakers. A marvelous performer. I saw Dave Bing at the end of his career. OK. I'm going to tell you what. Johnny Dawkins is one of the baddest new drivers. Yeah. <laughs> Johnny Dawkins, I like that. Dawkins into the four court. Yeah. Yeah. Out the side of Beautiful. Oh. To your point, I try to tell people, Johnny kind of helped put DC basketball yeah. on the map. AD. Uh, I put AD, AD in there. Dantley just does not miss. I put Grant in there. Grant was that good. Man, you put me on the spot, dude. From Landover, Maryland, number 34, Len Bias. High school, college, yep. born from Maryland. I mean, you have to You're put right. Lenny in that You're conversation. Right. You're right. We need the five. We need the five, man. You know what, Kermit Washington? Last 2020 man in college basketball. That's so right there. You know? Last 2020 guy, Kermit Washington. We go with Big Kermit. I'm not mad at that. Yes, sir, Kermit Washington. Oh, I forgot the six man. <laughs> six man. Scott, there's your three. It looks good. It is good all the way. How does six man come off. up the bench? Green light. Green light, <laughs> <laughs> 